Well, good evening, everybody. It's um, it's the morning here when I'm doing this. You're you're in the evening, so you're probably wondering why I'm wearing dark glasses for for this. Um, I'm here in Bembridge. It's the family's weekend of which me and the boat are hosting a few uh, little events here. The boat has become quite famous now because of its appearances on Ustream and YouTube, and of course, uh, Aquaholic. A nice man came along and interviewed me uh, on the boat and the boat's had three quarters of a million views in, in two months. So so that that's pretty good. So I'm just taking time off from all that and I'll be um, I'll be making a little film of the whole thing, which you can see uh, on Ustream. Uh, but we're going back to the old way of doing things today. So for the first five minutes, um, you people on um, you, you YouTube people, folks that are viewing YouTube who are not members of Ustream can see what we do and then I just carry on when I wave goodbye to you to our Ustream uh, members. The members are quite happy at the moment because we've just announced for the first time oh, in over uh, m nearly 10 years I'm doing my first what used to be called a DVD. Uh, the last one I did was called No Further Action which sold thousands and thousands and thousands of copies at whatever cost it was. Uh, to buy, uh, but now this one, which I'm filming uh, next week, is my first live uh, appearance, uh, my first concert that I have filmed, I think in about six or seven years, um, I, I'm not sure, it, but it was a bloody long while ago, but to Ustream members, it's free, so if you people that are not members of Ustream want to uh, see it yourselves, you can download it from the Ustream shop, of which you don't have to be a member to visit. And you can get them great t-shirts with SQUIRREL written on them as well, and squirrel mugs as well. Left-handed mugs, because the idiots print, printed it on the wrong side, but it doesn't really matter. Uh, and you can download that DVD, and you can pre-order it now. It's £9.99 if you want to download it and keep it uh, forever. Or, if you have uh, any sense, you could sign up to Ustream. Uh, and and get it uh, for nothing like the rest of our members but I'm really really looking forward to that and we're going to start a series of them as well uh, the second one being the great uh, Danny Posthill one of Britain's youngest superstars uh, who's going to be speaking as well but in the meantime let's just talk about things I've been looking at the news today and what has made me laugh is this, is the blatant fake news that goes on there's lots of fake news I saw something the other day where it said that Rashford, uh, their nice uh, Marcus Rashford, it said he, he, he was accused by someone of profiting out of what he did. Well, don't be so ridiculous. That young man might not be the, you know, he could have a go at him for missing a penalty and the idiots will have a go, at, uh, the racists will have a go, but for heaven's sake, don't accuse that man of trying to help children. Uh, it's not the children's fault that the mothers are all smoking and got... Uh, the latest mobile phone and drink and widescreen TVs. No, someone has to step in and help the children and he's persuaded the government to do that. So well done him. But someone said he's profiting about that. They didn't actually say it said maybe someone said and someone's accused. Well, I don't think that's the case at all. If you've got proof, let's see it rather than just accusing for the sake of it. And of course, there was a follow up thing today to say that he is uh, spending time with his family on a £43,000 a year boat. Well, you know, good luck to him. Let's get him out of the way of all these nutters having a go. In fact, I'd like you to meet him now on this boat. Marcus, come for... He's gone training, uh, so he's not here today. The other thing that really, really made me laugh before we move on is Katie Hopkins. Now, I know Katie Hopkins. I don't share her views. I don't even think she shares her views, really. Um, <laughs> I think she just likes to have a go. She takes what I see as, as funny and ridiculous. She takes it quite seriously and she wants to moan and she gets on people's tits a bit. But I don't think what happened here, the, the mail, we've got it here, it says uh, Katie Hopkins. Well, first of all, it was reported that Katie Hopkins has been expelled from whatever it was she was doing in there, Big Brother or I'm a Celebrity Get Me Out of Here or something like that, from Australia and five £500 for saying for saying that she's going to flaunt the rules and for saying that she would like to open the bedroom door of her hotel room uh, to the room service porter naked uh, without a mask. Well, it says in the newspapers today, uh, well, in the mail, actually, Katie Hopkins has been fined £500 and deported from Australia for opening her door 
naked uh, without wearing a mask. So what do we believe? That is absolutely total fake news. And what does anyone do about it? No. And the person that wrote about that, can you write in your newspaper tomorrow, is it true or is it not true? So if it wasn't true, your first report uh, was the truth. If it was a lie, do you know what I'm saying? Please try and print the truth. It, it, it can be quite scary. Most of the shit that I've had over the while is because it's been badly reported in the newspapers or it's been reported in a way that suits the newspaper's narrative. So, so let us move on. OK, so so there. Let's just before I go, uh, say goodbye to you people on YouTube. We've got to do something about this pinging. And so I've given this title on YouTube. Pinging is minging. And we've got to stop it. We've got to stop this silly pinging. Uh, we just got to stop it. Bin the ping. That's it. That's my new thing. Bin the ping. Pinging is minning. Bin the pin. Pinging is minning. Bin the pin. Pinging is minning. Bin the pin. Look what's happened now. Look what's happened to Keir Stauber. Keir Stauber that been pigged. It been pigged. And is that to so far to date? It is rude. But uh, with you can't even see Fred Flintstone or Bab Bab or anybody from the rest of the Flintstones. And it's bloody ridiculous. And uh, before we know it. The shops are going to be empty. We won't be able to go anywhere, so we'll be locked down but knocked out. <coughs> There's a fantastic businessman called Quasi Quartang. He's a nice bloke, black man, big, huge, handsome fella, great guy. And uh, he's got to sort this, and I think he will sort it. I think they're making an announcement today, so let's see. Uh, so, all the best on YouTube. Don't forget, if you want to see my new DVD, join up to Ustream. Join up to Ustream anyway. I tell you, you'll enjoy it. If not, just cancel it. It's, you know, it's a piece of cake. You can't even buy a pint of lager for what it costs to send. And it's not just me. There's thousands and thousands of programs on there. Some of them are quite good. Okay, let's move on.